Hallo und herzlich willkommen zurück zu Life is Strange. Wir sind gerade auch am Diner. Ich wollte gerade mit dem Polizisten reden. That officer looks nicer than wannabe cop David Madsen. Hello, sir. Hi, young lady. You look a little lost. Hungry. Just hungry and thinking about what to eat. Now that is a real problem at the uh, two wells. I can never decide. Joyce's pumpkin pie or grilled mac and cheese. How well do you know Joyce? I know her delicious grub. Everybody at the station comes here. We take care of this place like it's our own kitchen. And Joyce, like she's our, our mother. So you know Chloe? Sadly, we all know Chloe down at the station. <sighs> Poor Joyce. Just heard that Chloe even had a pot dealer in her room. Uh, who told you that? I didn't hear it on the police scanner. Joyce said the weed belonged to Chloe's friend, but I highly doubt that. Joyce didn't tell you who? She wouldn't. Afraid I'd go arrest somebody, as if I would. I'd just tell that loser to stay the hell away from Chloe, or else. <laughs> just kidding. Besides, David Madsen's watching over. Is she a friend of yours? I know her. Then you know she's a handful. Hmm. She can be, but she can also be a good friend who shows up when you need her. Sounds like you're a good friend. I wish she would be a great daughter and not cause Joyce so much stress. I guess you're friends with David Madsen. I wouldn't use that word. We know each other. Why do you ask? He kinda has a reputation at Blackwell. I have respect for David. He served his country. He found his calling at Blackwell. At the station, we're happy David is exactly where he is. <laughs> Not everybody can be a cop. I have to go now. Enjoy your breakfast. By the oh, way, yeah. one thing I can tell you for certain is to stay away from that RV outside. I usually stay away from sketchy parked vehicles. Wise policy. The guy who lives in it, Frank, is pretty sketchy himself. That's all I can say for now. I should finish up my coffee and get to work. I wouldn't last one day as a trucker. Those rigs are too damn big. I don't feel like talking right now. Okay. I gotta deliver a load of breakfast to my stomach. Over now. Over and out. Truckers have such a romantic life. Always on the road. Uh, hello? Pardon moi, but you're in my eyesight. Isn't everything in here with an eyesight? I don't care for your tone. You sound like Joyce. How does Joyce sound? Bossy and smartass. Like you. Joyce rules. I want to be exactly like her when I grow up. Looks like you're on your way. I've been coming to this dive for three years, and Joyce gives me shit like it's going out of style. That's how she rolls. That's why I worship her every move. Good. I can't wait to see you flipping greasy bacon in a diner when you grow up. Exactly like Joyce. Now pardon me while I get back to my coffee. So Justin is such a mellow dude. What's up, Justin? Getting my coffee on before I cut class and destroy some rails. Shouldn't you be taking photos? Hi, sure. I am always taking photos. I am a camera. You crack me up, Maxter. Of course I'm baked. So I'll laugh at anything. You should be studying, bad boy. So where's all your homework, schoolgirl? School. Speaking of buds, I saw your bro Trevor sneaking out of Dana's room. Trevor finally told me about him and Dana hooking up. He got there first, so I snooze and I lose. See you later, Max. Oh, yeah. Trevor looks as happy as Dana did. Hey, Trevor. Holla, Max. By the way, I know you saw me in the dorm. Hey. Yeah, I saw you coming out of Dana's room. Yeah, and I finally had to tell Justin because, well, he was into her too. 
How did Justin react? I got him blazed. He was cool. Nobody has secrets in Blackwell anyway. See you in class, Max. Er war schon mit Joint vertröstet. Auch nicht schlecht. Drool. Want everything. Oh, Muffins sind super. <lacht> Forgot about the fishing wall of fame. Two Whales, deiner Anglerauszeichnung. Gewinner jeden Monat. Weißer Stör, gefangen von Dick Weber. Stahlkopfforelle, gefangen von Andy Barry. Königslachs, gefangen von Rich Conrad. Alter, rechts oben, ey, das ist ja ein Riesenfieber. Wow, Ken Kesey with Joyce? That's so perfect. Für Joyce, die besten Burger und wundervollste Atmosphäre in Oregon. Auf bald, Kay. I got you, babe. <lacht> How apropos. But no fucking way. Oh, das ist ein Bild. That's funny. Our family never went well watching. Looks fun. Ob Wahl gut schmeckt? Benjo-Stück, Gitarrenstück. Ich bin für Gitarre. Na, 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 na. Doch nicht so eine Gitarre, ich wollte... Ach man. And there she is. A lovely young woman. How are you doing, Max? Hi, Joyce. It's nice to see you again. You look the same. <laughs> like I'm still a waitress at Two Whales after all these years. No, like you still look pretty. Nice save, kid. You're still smart. But not that smart. Now you get busted for smoking pot. <laughs> I heard the whole sordid story from David. I'm sorry this was how you had to meet him. He's a good man, no matter what Chloe says. Yeah, I'm sure. I don't even smoke, like, ever. It was almost an accident. It was very stupid. I'm, I'm sorry. Oh, it surprised me fierce. I was hoping you could be a good influence in her life now. I will be. Promise. I know things were hard for you and Chloe. I feel bad I didn't call. Now my folks are in Seattle and I'm all alone at Blackwell. It's my karma. You did the right thing. You moved forward with your life. I did after William passed on. Chloe? Chloe chose to stay angry. Anyway, I hope we see more of you. Chloe needs an old friend again. Joyce, I am so sorry about William. I have great memories of him. I'm glad, Max. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Even if Chloe doesn't understand yet. Chloe must have changed a lot during that time. Oh, she hit all the phases. Expulsion, running away, drugs, bad boys, tattoos, piercings, blue hair. <laughs> Now she's got to rebel against her stepfather. I see why, I mean. Do you? He's not as much of a hard ass as you think. But you did tell him you had a joint, right? You took that responsibility? Mm, yeah. I did. And I am sorry. I don't want Chloe in any more trouble. Or me. Nobody's in trouble over a doobie, Max. And I admire that you took the heat for Chloe. Like a great friend. But Chloe does push David, and it's not fair. He paid his dues in a war. He does care about her, along with all the students at Blackwell. Ja, aber come on, ey. Das eine hat doch nichts mit den anderen zu tun. Der da im Krieg gedient hat und zurückkommt, kann er nicht sagen. 
Äh, oder kann ich alle sagen, er hat gedient. Er war awesome. Das funktioniert so nicht. Das eine, das zivile und das dienstliche, das klappt nicht. He cares about Kate Marsh? David mentioned her, but I'll stay out of his business. I won't patrol Blackwell and he won't cook at the diner, you know? I saw him arguing with Kate. I thought you might know why. Nice try, Nancy Drew. But next to you, there's only one student I'm worried about. And she's not even in school anymore. So, now let's get down to the nitty gritty. What do you want to eat? Uh, bacon omelette or a Belgische Waffe? What is a Belgische Waffe? Is that a difference? Ach, ich bestell einfach mal. The last good Belgian waffle I had was here when I was 13 years old. So, bring it on. Now finish your coffee. Ach, ein Bier wird schöner. La, 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 One Belgian la, la. waffle for the hungry girl, pronto. One Belgian waffle at 12 o'clock high. I love the delicious anticipation of breakfast. The only thing that's changed on the menu are the prices. Wow, oh, a große Karte, oder? Für einen Diner. Mal schauen. Frühstück. Eier. Art des Hauses. Frühstücksschießball. Apfelwurst. Ih, das ist eine Apfelwurst. Seesternpfannkuchen. Goldenes Kartoffelomelett. Frischer Haferbrei. Bleh. Gute Laune Waffel. Verschiedene Cornflakes. Oh, Cornflakes sind super. Belgische Waffel und frittierter Fisch. Beilern. Bacon, Bigfoot. Hash Browns. Apfelwurst. Alter, was ist Apfelwurst? Belgien mit Frischkäse? Krabbenküchlein. Zwei Scheiben Toast. Getränke. Was oh, gibt's kein Bier? Tch, doofer Laden. Scheiße. Nerd Graffiti. Warren must have been here. Oh yes, Black Coffee. You will be mine. Can I get some beer and bacon before I die? This is a diner, not a bar. No uh. beer? <laughs> Looks like you had plenty. Stick with the bacon. Coffee. This is like fourth dimensional deja vu. I keep going back in time. No beer? What, what kind of dive is this? This is good. They get to the off. Incoming. The lighthouse looks so mysterious. I wish I could stay in this moment forever. I guess I actually can now. I can hear your stomach but then it wouldn't be a moment. Here, you'll love this. I'm drooling like a baby. Still can't believe you're a woman. When I look at pictures of Chloe, ugh. Mm, speak of the devil. Mom and Max, together again. And Chloe looking for a free meal. You put your whole damn college fund on your tab. I'm treating Chloe for breakfast. Are you atoning for yesterday? Oh god, Mom, please do not give Max any shit for that. She apologized. I know she did. Max is a good girl. A woman. She's 18 now. Too old to get lectures from you or Sergeant Pepper. Call him David if you don't want to be lectured. You only get one damn slice of bacon a day. You guys are still the same. Another reason to blow this town. What is this shit on the jukebox? So schlecht für nichts gar nicht. Was soll's mal jetzt? Oh, wir sind zu Ende gekommen. Äh, wenn wir mal Pause machen, dann mal sehen, was Chloe und Max so im nächsten Part zu bereden haben. Bis dann, Leute. Ciao.